Hi everyone, welcome to Apple Tech page. In this tutorial, I will show you how to fix could not sign out. There was a problem removing this iPhone from your account. Try signing out again error on iPhone or iPad. Solution 1 is Disable Low Power Mode. Make sure that your iPhone is not on low power mode because some users have said that they get this error when low power mode is turned on. Once they turned off this option, they could sign out from iCloud. To check that, go to settings app. Next, find and tap on battery. Now turn off low power mode if it's turned on. Once done, try to sign out your iCloud account. Solution 2 is Restart your iPhone. First, tap on settings icon from the home screen. Now scroll down the screen and tap on general. Again scroll down the screen and tap on shutdown. Next, turn off your device by dragging the slide to power off slider. Wait for a minute and turn on your device again. Solution 3 is put your iPhone into airplane mode and disable it. To do that, go to settings app. Now enable airplane mode and lock your device. Wait for 30 seconds. Then disable airplane mode again. Solution 4 is Refresh Wi-Fi or cellular data Whether you are using Wi-Fi or cellular data, turn off and turn on it. If you are using Wi-Fi, then restart your Wi-Fi router. Solution 5 is Force restart your iPhone or iPad. If you are using iPhone 8 and later models or iPad without home button, then do the following steps. First, what you have to do is quickly press and release the volume up button. Next, quickly press and release the volume down button. Finally, press and hold the side or power button until you see the Apple logo. If you are using iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, then do the following steps. Press and hold the side button and volume down button at the same time until you are getting the Apple logo on your iPhone screen. If you are using iPhone 6s Plus and earlier models, an iPad with home button, then do the following steps. Press and hold the home button and sleep or wake button at the same time until you see the Apple logo. Solution 6 is check for software update. Make sure that your device is connected to the internet and launch settings app. Next, find and tap on general. Now tap on software update. If update is available, tap on download and install to start the process. You have to wait until the downloading process is complete. Solution 7 is Turn on set automatically for date and time. First, go to settings app. Next, tap on general. Now find and tap on date and time. Now turn on set automatically. If already turned on, then turn off and on it. Solution 8 is Reset Network Settings. This process resets your connected Wi-Fi networks and passwords. First, go to Settings app. Next, find and tap on General. Now scroll down the screen to bottom and tap on Reset. Select Reset Network Settings. 
Next, you will be asked to enter the passcode of your device. Again, tap on Reset Network Settings to confirm this process. Solution 9 is Reset All Settings. When you do Reset All Settings, all your customized settings will be deleted like alarm, brightness, notifications and etc. and it will go back to default settings. To do that, go to Settings app. Then tap on General. Now scroll down the screen and tap on Reset at bottom. Here you have to select Reset All Settings. Then enter the passcode if prompted. Finally tap on Reset All Settings in the pop-up window to confirm this process. Thanks for watching. Do like, share and subscribe to Apple Tech page.